It's said that if cooking oil gets too hot and catches fire, pouring water on it can create a 30-foot fireball and turn into a full-blown disaster. And stories like this pop up in the news all the time. But is this really true or just another urban myth? To find out, Adam set out to uncover the truth. They headed to a fire department training ground, since this kind of experiment could only be done under professional supervision. The plan? Test three different types of cooking oil. Each pan was fitted with a temperature sensor, and once the oil ignited, a beaker placed above would release eight ounces of water into the fire. First up was canola oil. Jamie lit the burner, and within minutes, the oil temperature soared past 650 degrees Fahrenheit. At that point, it reached what's known as the auto-ignition threshold, where the surface spontaneously bursts into flames. Adam pulled the rope, releasing the water into the burning oil. A massive fireball instantly erupted. Although the explosion was intense, it wasn't quite the 30 feet tall that the rumor claimed. Still, the fireball was terrifying enough to shake anyone watching. That's because water instantly vaporizes into steam when it hits burning oil, expanding rapidly in volume. This sudden expansion causes a violent reaction, essentially making the water explode inside the oil, spreading the flames even further and increasing the fire's intensity. Next up was peanut oil. Would it put on an even more dramatic show? 